I always do my best to stay healthy and active. I usually try to work out every day because it allows me to become stronger and faster. Also, exercising releases endorphins, making you happier. However, if I'm ever feeling sick, tired, or worn out, and I'm not in a good state to work out, I'll take a break. If your body needs rest, give it some. Let me go on a quick rant. Salads are so underrated. Not only are they delicious, but they are an amazing way to get in vegetables that your body needs. If you don't like salads, try experimenting with different toppings and dressings, and I think you'll be surprised. I had some leftover charcuterie board stuff, so just like meat and cheese and crackers for dinner, and then Kate, Gracie, and Lottie are coming over soon. Hi, Lottie. Please follow me. I'm literally the best person on the I only have one subscriber right now. It's oh Gracie Buxton. No, no, no. Mine's 2026.kcrane. Mine's the same thing, but Gracie Buxton, so you guys should go follow me. At this point, you all probably know that my diet consists of protein pancakes, oatmeal, ravioli, salads, prosciutto rolls, flautas, and bolt bars. While it may start to get boring watching me eat the same foods over and over again, that's what I love to eat. However, I really want to switch it up some. A lot of my current favorite foods I only recently started eating. I want to start trying new foods and finding new favorites. Oh my way guys, hi. This is another Reese cam. Um, I just got back from the swim team, so I have a bunch of layers on because I am freezing cold. The pool was freezing. Yeah, so ow, she just kicked me. One thing I'm really excited to start doing this summer is going out to eat more on my own or with friends. In the school year, I don't have much time to do this, but in the summer, I have lots of time. In my area, there are lots of places that are just a bike ride away, and I plan to take advantage of that. and then strides. Man, that was a tough run. <laughs> Recently, I've been experimenting with when I eat breakfast. I used to wake up, then immediately eat, but I usually wasn't very hungry and it didn't always feel good to work out right after eating. Instead, I've started either working out first thing in the morning and then eating, or eating something light, like an egg or a piece of toast, working out, then having a big breakfast. This has been working a lot better for me. I just got some toiletries and clothes for camp and I'll wear the clothes outside of camp, but that's the main reason I got them. So I'll give you guys a little haul. I'm not trying anything on though because I just tried it all on at the store and I don't want to do that again. 
This is not for camp. This is just because I needed some micellar water. And then I got some stuff from Lululemon and Athleta. Ben and Jerry's ice cream is so good. My mom won't usually buy it for me, but when she does, I enjoy every bite. How am I filming while we're riding my bike? Honestly, I don't know. I must look so stupid right now. As you all probably know, I love Caroline Griffin workouts. I used to not be very into YouTube workouts, but I cannot get enough of hers. I've become so much stronger because of her, and if you are ever looking for a good workout, check her out. While this doesn't have anything to do with what I eat in a week or my workouts, I want to remind you all to take care of yourself. Self-care is so necessary. If you want to hear more of my thoughts on self-care, I'd recommend to check out my self-care week video where I talk all about it. I just did hill repeats for the first time ever, and that was tiring. My legs hurt. It felt good though, too. I'm grabbing some water, and then I'm going to get on the foam roller. I want to remind you all that recovery is just as important as the workout itself. After a run or workout, be sure to stretch, roll out your muscles, drink lots of water, and eat some protein. We 
are at the Please come find us in a hot hope down and kill her. Dry Lucky Charms is the way to go. I've just been sitting around and editing for most of today. I did eat lunch and now I think I'm going to go swim some laps. I would go to our country club pool because the laps are a lot longer and it's just better to be swimming laps and stuff. But I feel really awkward having people watch me swim laps. So I guess I'll just do it in our pool. Unless it's really bad, then I might go to the country club, we'll see. One thing I think is so important is cross training and switching up your workouts. Just going on a run or following YouTube workouts can get boring. When there are so many different ways to stay active, why stick with only one? Next time you work out, try swimming, biking, yoga, or just something new. What is this? You guys can't even see on camera how much it's raining. Why does the weather just decide to do this? And out of nowhere too, what the heck? I just went on a run for a little over 30 minutes. I think I did four miles and it was kind of humid outside. <laughs> Definitely very sweaty and I'm gonna do some stretching now. We are at the club for brunch and I'm trying to like film subtly. There's like no one else out here, but there's people on the golf course, there's people inside, so. Hey guys, so we're at the pool and it is raining. It's a Hobie just went and ordered the pizza for us to share. I was actually gonna get a grilled cheese, but I was like, I want pizza. And then my sister bought me my jacket because I was kind of chilly. And yeah, um, we're at for Kate, but she's literally at our house. Because I literally looked on her life, so she's sixteen. She's at our house. So Kate, if you're seeing this, please come to the pool. Yeah, should we actually call her right now? And that is the end of the video. Thank you guys all so much for watching. If you liked it, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. And if you want to see more videos like it, then subscribe to my channel and turn on notifications so you don't miss a video. For a chance to get a shout out, share this video with one or more of your friends and let me know in the comments down below. I love you all and I will see you in the next one. Bye! Hi, Clara!